Well, hi there. You might be wondering why I'm standing in my bathtub with a rain jacket on. So this is the Marmot Minimalist Jacket. Just got from REI with a member dividend. And pre-sip, full zip pants. So all said, retail cost, uh, 200 for the jacket, 100 for the pants, 300 total. If you can see that. And what do you do with your gear before you take it in the field? You test it. So that's exactly what we're going to do. This jacket's fully seam sealed. I haven't bought new rain gear since probably 2003 or 2004, easily. Uh, the pants are a size large. The jacket is an XL. I did that on purpose so I could wear this over the top of other non-waterproof jackets. Oops. Can't put the hood on like that. So, I figured we'd stand in here for a few minutes and see if this baby is functioning as advertised. All the zippers are sealed. The underarm zippers are sealed. Everything's good to go. So let's see what happens. Try to keep the water in the shower. to mention this is right out of the bag. It hasn't been washed or anything. The UPS guy just dropped it off. That's a pretty hot rain. Let's turn that down a little bit. There we go.
Well, that feels pretty good. Aside from a, uh, when I put my arms up like this, all the water that was on my hands went down my sleeve there. Other than that, uh, totally dry, tiny little bit of condensation. That's just from my own heat because uh, I was using uh, warm water. The uh, hood won't come down, which is kind of nice unless you unzip a little bit. Uh, pretty impressed. Water's beating up right off the jacket and the pants. Um, I mean, that, that simulated one hell of a rainstorm. I think that would survive a hurricane. So, uh, there we go. Um, just a little bit of wetness inside here because, again, I, I put my arms up uh, like that when I was messing with these. And it actually ran down my arms, a little pool right there at my elbow. But uh, that was my own fault. Pretty impressive. I'm going to throw this in the wash. I'm going to take this camping this weekend because it's supposed to rain. So there we go.